Welcome to the BOA How-To Series. Today I'll be showing you how to crimp a hose using the P18 hand pump crimper. Before any crimping is done, you will need to identify what hose and hose tails you will be needing. This is easily identified with our thread identification resource page. Now we have this information, we can now identify the crimp spec. By using the BOA Resources crimp spec identification page, this is very simple. This is done by finding the type of fitting you are using and the size of hose. In this demonstration, this gives us a crimp spec of 21.3. You're now ready to assemble the hose for crimping. First, place the ferrule over the hose. And then insert the hose tail making sure the collar of the ferrule aligns with the groove in the fitting. You may need to use silicon. When using one piece fittings, make sure you line the fitting up next to the hose and mark where the fitting should come to when pushed all the way home. Now we have the crimp spec, we need to choose the right die size. This is simply the die size below the required crimp spec measurement. In today's demonstration, this would be the 19mm dies. Now we have the 19mm die set in, we need to set the micrometer at 2.3 to give us a crimp spec of 21.3mm. One full turn of the micrometer is equal to 1mm. Now you should make sure your hand pump is on vent as shown and the release valve is tightened. Now you're ready for crimping. When crimping, make sure the ferrule is completely in the dies. Using the hand pump, pump until the red light turns on. This indicates you have reached your crimp spec. Releasing the pressure valve, the head will open. Always measure the completed crimp with the verniers. Any questions or queries, please see the contacts below. Thank you for watching.